Good morning, class. I am so excited that we are going to be doing a fun art project for math today. We are going to be covering a design with our pattern blocks. Even though all of our fish are the same shape, we can do lots of different designs. I am going to use my pencil to trace my shapes there so that I have made a little trapezoid. And then I'm going to take my red marker because my trapezoid is red and I am going to fill in that whole area with red so that I can see the four different ways that I do my pattern. I'm going to be making a very fun little fish picture. Now I have my hexagon. I'm going to use my pencil. Draw right along there. So now I have a hexagon. And my hexagon was yellow. So I'm going to use my yellow crayon, or not crayon, marker. And I am going to color this part yellow. All right, let's see if it fits. My triangle, my hexagon, and my trapezoid. Hmm, what's another way that I could design this little fish? The rhombus and the triangle for the tail of the fish. I think I'm gonna try to make this one as much, have as much blue and green in it as I can. Let's see. Oh, that fits nicely as if I could use another one. Oh, there we go. It's almost all green and blue. Well, it is all green and blue. Now I'm gonna use my pencil and I'm gonna draw this design on it and then color it. So we'll do this part. Now I'm gonna use the colors. All of these sections are blue. And these two little ones here are green. I'm going to color my little two green triangles first. I know that you're going to have a lot of fun designing yours today. Now these ones are all blue. So I'm going to use my blue marker and color these ones blue. I have designed two different fish and I'm going to try doing this one a different way. I have triangles on the tips of both of these fish and I think I'm going to see if I can use a trapezoid there this time. The red pattern blocks are trapezoids. Hmm, I'm going to see if I can make it just green a little bit on the top, almost so that it looks like it's eye. There we go. Now I am going to use my pencil to trace my trapezoids. When I'm tracing, I hold the shape down so that it doesn't move. And you see I have one, two, three trapezoids and one triangle. I am going to color my trapezoids red. I've been able to pattern my fish in three different ways. There's so many different ways and I want you to choose your own ways. I have one more fish to design and color. What if I did this one as green and as green as I can? The tail can be made out of three triangles. That's the same shape as a trapezoid. I covered my design with lots and lots of triangles. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight triangles and one rhombus. I could even, I could have covered all of them with green. I am going to use my pencil to trace my shapes and color them. Class, I hope that today you have a lot of fun covering a design and then 
coloring it. I want you to see how many different ways you can cover your design. Friends, today we learned that we can cover a design in many different ways. We also learned that our shapes, when we put them together, it can cover another shape. Two triangles equal the same size and shape as a, as a rhombus. And a trapezoid is the same as a rhombus and a triangle or even three triangles. We can cover shapes and designs in many different ways. And I want you to play with your shapes and your designs and learn and discover more and more about your shapes. Have a wonderful day class. Bye-bye.